I'm so sorry, Libra. Welcome back. Um, I got cut off and I can't join these two videos together. So if you're tuning into this reading, Libra, this is part two of part one of your weekly Love Vibes reading. Okay, I'm really, really sorry. Apologies. Um, I had someone come and knock at the door and I had to answer the door. Um, so yeah, really, really sorry. So if you're tuning into this reading, please Libra, go back to part one because yeah, a lot of the nuts and bolts of this reading is in that first part of your reading. So we were at the three of wands, which speaks to you looking at your future. What is it that you want? Do you want to wait for this person or do you want to move forward? And, and Libra, I'm sensing here that you're strongly just getting on with it. Okay. Um, you're in motion. You're not um, deliberating here, even though there is some confusion surrounding what's going to happen. Um, you're still getting on with it. Okay, that's just how it's coming through. Now, we do have the Five of Wands here, which is telling me, you know, you're, you're battling some internal conflict right now. Um, but you're, you're, nonetheless, you're getting on with it. Okay, you, you're going about your daily tasks. You're still putting one foot forward in front of the other, even though we've got this Five of Wands here. Okay, which tells me that there's a little bit of internal conflict going on, which is which could be contributing to a little bit of stress um, regarding, you know, your future with this person. Now, also too with the Five of Wands, I feel like this comes through as an advice card for you, Libra, is just to choose your battles, um, and I feel like you're choosing your battles wisely. I feel like you're not wasting time trying to draw information or answers from this person if they're not willing to give them to you. Like you're better than that. You're not going to sink down to that level. All right. So that's what's coming through there. Now we've got the eight of wands. Um, and this is really representative of things looking up things looking fertile, things looking positive. Um, this could also speak to positive information or messages or communication coming towards you, okay? Um, I feel like the person that you're dealing with over here, if you're currently not speaking with this person and if they've been holding back from you, from giving you particular information or answers to questions that you have asked them, I feel like they're going to just, it's all going to come all at once, okay? And it might, it might overwhelm you, um, but I feel like this person does want to come towards you and move things into a more positive direction, okay? But that won't happen until this octopus person gets very clear on what it is that they want. Okay, now with this lightning strike, I feel like something's going to happen to them unexpectedly to make them realize what it is that they need to do. And I feel like if you are disconnected at this time, I feel like it's going to happen really, really quickly. It's going to happen really, really fast. You may not expect it and it might, it might be when you're you know, you're least going to expect this and it's going to happen when you're just getting about life, not worrying about the other person. Okay, it's just going to come to you just like that. All right, because they're going to notice and they're going to feel the shift within your energy, Libra. They're going to go, oh, hang on a second. Hmm, my Libra doesn't care. My Libra isn't focused on me. My Libra isn't giving me attention. And they're going to be drawn to that energy, right? It's just human nature. It's what people do. Then we've got the Six of Pentacles over here. So what I'm getting here, the Six of Pentacles is a nice uh, message in this card because over here we have a disconnect. We have two people not seeing eye to eye, right? We have an imbalance within this connection. Okay, someone might be more um, superior and the other person might be more 
um, submissive, okay? There's just, there's not this equal balance. But with this card here of the Six of Pentacles, this is about equal balance. This is about an equal give and take within a relationship, partnership or union, okay? Now, I feel with the Six of Pentacles that this connection, this disconnect is going to balance out. It will balance out. I see it here. All right. It's going to come back into perfect harmony. Look, I really just see these two cards here as very, very positive. I feel like that um, there is a strong possibility that this can work out. Okay. This can work out. Once you get rid of the petty little arguments and the, and the silly little conflicts that may be happening and occurring within this connection. All right. I also see here too, with the Six of Pentacles, that maybe Libra, you need to step up, which you will do, which will bring this person back into balance. Okay, because this person that you're dealing with thinks that they have the upper hand. They think they're smart. They think they're intelligent. Okay, um, they think that they're pulling your strings, but in actual fact, it's going to be roles reversed. Okay, so yeah, I'm just going to leave it there, Libra, because it is looking like things, uh, there is a strong possibility that things are going to work out favorably for you. Um, whichever way you look at this. I do see positive communication coming towards you. I do see this balance within a connection. Um, so yeah, it's looking positive, Libra. Um, feel free to leave your likes and comments below. And until next time, I'll speak to you soon.